include everything. Hey guys, we are back in Code Combat. We're going to be doing, doing Logical Paths. As you can see, I already started it. So I refreshed it. We'll do it over again. I s struggled a little bit with it. Uh, a lot of words to read through. Uh, so let's go ahead and run this first see what's going on here. So he moves, then he moves here. It says, hero. This is 26, 24. So if either secret or A or B is true, take value path. So we do if secret A is equal, equal to true, or secret B is equally equal to true. There's a couple different ways we could do this, but we'll do it like this. We want to move to 32, 33. So move XY, 32, 33. So let's go ahead and run that and see if, what happens. And then we do, if secret B is not true, take the high path. I think we have to move back down. I want to go hero dot move XY. We want to move back down, 37, 25. Let's see, and then we'll say, let's see if that's what they want us to do. All right, and then we'll say, if secret B is not true, take the high path. And we'll say, if secret B is, is exactly equal to false or not true, uh, we'll go ahead and do it like this. We'll do, oops, not, not equals. So true, so that's how they phrase it. So this is also false. Uh, we will go ahead and move to 4433. So move XY, 4433. Let's go ahead and So else, uh, else move x, y to 4415. Gotta run that. And then finally we want to move to 4924. Run that one more time. Fifty twenty-four. circle. Why not? Boolean logic variables and basic syntax. Trying to open another treasure chest. Trying to make that money. Um, sometimes the struggle is a little hard. Alright. Uh, Lukacs has led you to another grove with enough treasure. You just use the answer. A few more riddles using ands and ors. So, move the hero to get... This. Blah, blah. If all three values are true, take the high path. Otherwise, take the low path. So if secret D... So if all these are true, move there. Else... Alright. So we'll do... We'll create another example. We'll set secret D is equal to secret A or secret B or secret C. And we'll say if secret D else so if one of those is true run that 
else. So if secret A, B, or C is true, um, take the left path. Let's go around this and see what happens. So. Is this the left path? Like move back to here? If all five values are true, take the high path. Otherwise, take the left path. Otherwise, go. Alright, I guess this is left. So, 2025. Move XY. 20. 25. Else. 4024. Let's go around that. All right. So if all five values, five. I'm gonna run this one more time. Let's see what this guy says. The secrets are true, true, and true. If they're all true, take the high path. If any of the secrets are true, take the left path. If all the values are true, take the high. I think this is supposed to be three. Um, so I say, if all five values are true, take the high. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Try the we'll, we'll just put this secret E. All right, I see what's going on now. So um, secret E. So what we need to do is compare secret A, B, C, D, and E. So if secret F, and then we'll say var secret F is equal to var secret F is equal to secret D or do it in order A. And secret B and secret C and secret D and secret E. So if all these are true, take the high path, otherwise take the low path. So if all are true, so um, high path is back to here. Uh, 30, 33. Move 30, 33. Else, 31, 15. like our code went haywire. It's 4035. Take the left path, otherwise go right. So, take the left path, otherwise go right. So, we move to 2025. So if secret E is true, move to 2025. 20, if it's false, low path, left path. Or 
numbers go right. So we'll say 4025. I think that's what I meant to put in there. Alright, now submit. There we go. Just uh, messed up a little bit on the. On the little... All right, guys, we're back in Free Code Camp, Backwoods Forest. We're doing JavaScript for this one, and we are on logical conclusion. Let's go ahead and uh, jump right in. I got the music turned off, but uh, I think I may turn it back on. So we need to uh, rescue Lucas or Lucas, however you want to say it. Let's see. I can barely hear that. Let's go ahead and turn that up a little bit for you guys. All right, cool. So um, what we need to do is from this spot, just move here, here, and then here, based off of the if statements. So if say true, so we're gonna create a variable called this is Ophi. That's gonna be equal to the result. That is if A or B is true, so secret, a or secret B and C is true. That also will be false, so we'll do and and. We'll say secret, secret, secret C. Go ahead and close that in. Like so. Nope. And then on this guy right here. 2636, we want to then go ahead and hero dot move, that's y. And from there, oh, xy being the 2737. 2737. And then we want our hero to say our variable, which is going to supposed to be true if we did this correctly. And that's just going to be tsofi. So let's go ahead and run this and make sure everything's working according to plan. So you should go here, here. Novesty! Which I believe it's this What a ting! So cool. Next we're supposed to move the hero to 3734. So let's go ahead and copy over two lines of code. This will be easy enough. So we're gonna copy over the move, because he's gonna move no matter what, and this time he's just gonna move to 3734. And then we're going to create a variable, and this one we'll call Istvan. Ist, Istvan. And then it is say true if Istvan A or C is true. So we're going to go ahead and say secret A or secret C, and B or C is true. And secret B is true. So are the is one of their is one of A or B, C true, or is and is one of B or C is true? That's all we're asking here. Secret C. So there's our variable. Let's put in this. That's fun. Let's go ahead and run it. What a ting! There's that. And then finally, we need to do it one more time, so we'll just go ahead and copy over all this. This guy's name is Cecilla, so let's fill that out. And it's saying if A, or B, if A and B are true. Alright, cool. So secret A, and then secret B. Or, is there or? Or secret B secret B A and B is true or secret B is true and C is not true. Is equal to true. Not equal to 
true. And finally, take one last bracket. All right, now let's run this. Oh, now we gotta move our hero. Apparently it wants us to use strict mode, so uh, that's why we have to use the um, triple equals, because we're checking the value and the type, not just the value. All right, uh, and then finally, where is this guy located? He is at 39.22. Novesty. 22. What a we're team! Just gonna change the name here to what the guy's gonna say. Let's go ahead and run it. Looks like we did it, boys. We did it. We're going to the, uh, the kingdom here. All right, not too shabby. Submit it finally. Novesty. Uh, very nice. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to check out my collaboration with Eric Surf 6 going over how to get started coding. And if you're looking for some coding help, go to Code Mentor using the annotation or card. And if you're looking for internships or part time jobs or full time jobs as a student or a recent grad, check out wayup.com. See you guys next time.